Something that comes up all the time when I am browsing social media is people are confused. What is a tornado watch? What is a tornado warning? The amount of times I've seen someone say a tornado watch has been issued, I'm taking shelter, or do I need to take shelter, something like that. It is astoundingly high. This is not good. So this video, if you're watching this video and you're confused, what is a tornado watch? What is a tornado warning? What do these mean exactly? Well, let's dive in a little bit. Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. My name is Rachel Sanner. This is Tornado Titans, where weather is for everybody. That includes you. You're here, you're trying to learn about tornado watches and tornado warnings. Weather's for you too. Welcome. Be sure to subscribe if you love weather content, if you wanna see storm chasing, live storm chasing, learn about weather, it's all here. Hit that subscribe button, enable notifications, and well, let's get started. So let's break this down for you really quick. A tornado watch. It is issued when conditions are favorable for tornadoes. A tornado warning, on the other hand, is issued when a tornado is indicated or sighted. Let's talk about what those mean. A tornado watch, uh, you know, conditions are favorable, means that they could happen. Things are in place that could lead to a tornado. And a tornado warning, on the other hand, is a tornado is indicated by radar or it's been sighted by people like me, storm chasers, something like that. That's the difference. But let's go a little bit deeper. It's a nice spring day with clouds beginning to bubble upwards. When a tornado watch is issued, the sky often looks like this. When meteorologists at the Storm Prediction Center issue a tornado watch, it means this sky could be conducive to tornado formation in the next few hours. That's because the atmosphere is unstable. You can see this by the clouds bubbling upwards. There's also a spinning of winds with height called wind shear, which you can also see in this cloud as it tilts over. Additionally, you can see how the cloud bases are pretty low. Yeah, that means there's a lot of moisture and humidity in the low levels. In meteorological terms, we have lift, instability, and wind shear present. All the conditions are here for tornadoes. So in response to that, the Storm Prediction Center issues a tornado watch because there could be tornadoes in the next few hours in this general region. Now, something you may not know about tornado watches is that there's actually two different types of tornado watches. You have your standard run of the mill tornado watch issued quite a bit throughout the year, already bad enough, already could see tornadoes, right? Well, what if I told you there's an especially bad tornado watch. It's called the Particularly Dangerous Situation Tornado Watch, or PDS for short. And this means literally the situation is particularly dangerous, long, tracked, strong, violent tornadoes possible. If you get one of these issued, you need to have a source of weather information really close by. Now, tornado watches are issued for, you know, four, five, six, seven hours into the future. They cover a large area and they're basically to say, hey, look, this could happen. Now, a tornado warning, conversely, on the other hand, much shorter, 15, 20 minutes, maybe 30 at tops, means a tornado is indicated, could be happening right now. If a storm chaser like me has seen one, it's gonna be observed. There's gonna be a confirmed tornado on the ground. When a tornado warning is issued, the sky will look at least a little like this. A supercell is ongoing and there is a rotating base. It is important to note that not all tornado warnings end up with tornadoes occurring and meteorologists often do not know if a tornado is happening when they issue a warning. That's where storm chasers come in. To our eyes, we can dissect a storm and relay this information back to meteorologists, letting them know that indeed, this storm is going to produce a tornado soon. And yes, that is exactly what is happening here. Tornado warning verified. Now, just like tornado watches, what I'm about to tell you, probably not surprising. What if I told you though, there is a more serious tornado warning? Yes, it's true. These are called tornado emergencies. Whenever a tornado emergency is issued, almost always, almost always, there is a large damaging very dangerous tornado happening, and you need to take those especially seriously. The first tornado emergency ever issued was May 3rd, 1999, as a large tornado barreled into 
the southern Oklahoma City metro area, including more. That tornado was rated an F5, infamous in the weather community. That was the first tornado emergency. Now they're issued whenever a big tornado is expected to impact people. So if you hear that, if you hear a tornado emergency, it's coming for you. That means we, storm chasers, have seen a tornado. It is definitely happening and it is definitely moving towards you. So please, if this happens, take your precautions now. Now it goes without saying, you should have a tornado action plan. We have resources on our website about this very thing. The link is in the description. Also, this card that just popped up, a whole playlist. There are so many videos on that playlist for storm preparedness. Any question you have is probably on there and has been answered, so check that out. And please, subscribe to this channel because if you like this, if you like learning about weather, like being coming more informed, more aware of what's going on, this channel is for you. It is totally for you, so subscribe. And remember, this channel's for you, weather's for you. Weather is for everybody. That includes, most especially, you. We will see you next time.